Learning Toolkit. The Curious Adventures of Tina T. Rex. Yay! Written by Shireen and Danny Baker. Illustrations by George Mayhew. One fine sunny day in the middle of May, Tina T. Rex went for a stroll. She didn't really mind where she went or what she'd find. Exploration was her only real goal. But on that fine day, as she went on her way, this curious Tyrannosaurus who went by the name of Tina, you might just have seen her because she lived at the same time as me and you. <gasps> as she walked down the street on her two big clawed feet, a big bus pulled up by her side. From her nose to tail tip, she was longer than it, which made her think as she slowed down her stride. Now don't get me wrong, this bus is rather long, but I'm longer, it's clearly the case. And while it's quite fast, I think it would come last if this big bus and I had a race. So off Tina bounded with a roar that sounded like an alligator mixed with a tiger. She beat that big bus, it trailed in her dust, and as she sped off, she waved to the driver. Next up on her jaunt, Tina suddenly thought, I wonder, how much do I weigh? As she was scratching her jaw, she saw a giant seesaw. How conveniently placed, one might say. So, Tina climbed on one side and enjoyed the ride as she hit the ground with a big bump. She thought, this is great, but I need a counterweight, when a snort from behind made her jump. Standing in a crowd, with horns large and proud, were some rhinos on a city-wide tour. Tina thought, it must be true that I'm heavier than a few of these rhinos, at least three, maybe four. She called out, hello there, do you have time to spare? And the lead rhino, whose first name was Stephen, said, sure, we have time. So up they all climbed. It took all of them to make the seesaw even. As she hopped off to go, Stephen said, I must know how even with such a large head, you move with such grace. You don't fall flat on your face, but you stay perfectly balanced instead. Well, Tina replied, I remain dignified using a tactic that will never fail. It's rather understated and perfectly weighted. My head's balanced by my lovely long tail. As her new friends departed, a big T-Rex started to realise she had quite a hunger. She really should eat and take a load off her feet. Tina simply could not wait any longer. Now, would Tina eat a plant? She'd say, I simply can't. With these sharp teeth, it'd be such a chore. So what did she eat? Well, she only liked meat. The technical term, carnivore. Tina had a meaty lunch, and to help her chew and crunch were the tools that really made her Tyrannus. The most powerful bite of all land animals outright. With 60 teeth that were bigger than bananas. Now her hunger was gone, she let out a huge yawn. <sighs> her tummy was telling Tina, go to bed. Her curiosity quelled, she now felt compelled to find a spot where she could lay her weary head. If you can believe, she had a trick up her sleeve that meant finding the perfect spot was a breeze. See, a T-Rex had great eyes, so you might be surprised that she could see about four miles away with ease. Tina bounded to her spot and thought, I've learned a lot as she lay on the ground for a rest. I'm fast, heavy and balanced with many other talents. I eat meat and my eyesight's the best. She sure was impressive and it's not at all excessive to hear Tyrannosaurus Rex reign supreme. Counting yummy looking sheep, she drifted off to sleep. What an amazing adventure. Sweet dreams. The end. T-Rex facts. Tyrannosaurus Rex means king of the tyrant lizards. <coughs> Pronounced ty ran no saw rus rex T-Rex was alive in the late Cretaceous period, 60 to 70 million years ago, and was discovered in North America and Asia. T-Rex was really big. It could grow as long as a bus. 
A fully grown T-Rex was really heavy. It weighed as much as four rhinos. In the movie Jurassic Park, to create the T-Rex roar, they combine the roars of an alligator and a tiger. Its teeth were the largest found from a carnivorous dinosaur, around 30 centimeters long. It had the most powerful bite of any land animal ever. Tyrannosaurus rex had really good eyesight and could see four times as far as humans. If you enjoyed this book, make sure to check it out on Amazon using this code. See you next time.